Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube Tech Guy. Hey guys, so today we are going to show you how to speed up and save battery life on your LG G7. Now, this is an LCD screen, which is a bit different because we can't do some of the tricks we usually do. So we're gonna try to go through more of the in-depth things that can really help out your battery life. So first of all, we're gonna go into settings and then go to the general tab. Then from here, we're going to go to about phone. Then we're gonna to go to software information and then you're going to find build number right here. You're gonna tap that several times. So that'll be the first step to unlock developer options. Now, if you notice when we go back here, we'll now have a new section called developer options. So for this first part, uh, again, don't do anything except what I'm telling you or else you can mess up your device. Uh, the first part is going to be under the drawing category right here. And you're gonna tap these three sections right here that say 1X under window animations. And you're going to change each of them to 0.5X. This basically tells your phone, hey, I know you can do things in half a second instead of a second, so do that. Uh, this is also where you can change uh, different Bluetooth, uh, basically codecs. So if you have certain headphones, you can actually make their audio quality better right here. And now we're going to go through the other things. So first thing is going to be under location. So we're going to go to the location section of the screen right here. And then we're going to go to scanning and then Bluetooth scanning off. This really doesn't help your location much and it really drains your battery life because Bluetooth is always running even if it's off. The other thing is you wanna change my places off in most cases. Now my places tells you your address and basically change your settings depending on that. However, unless you really set this up very detail oriented, this is only going to drain your battery life. So if you turn this off, it won't always be searching, oh, are you at your place or are you at this place? It will uh, kind of loosen that up a bit. So from here, we're now going to go to the battery section. And just one quick, uh, an obvious one I feel like, but I just always like to point it out is for battery saver, you can do extended. Now this basically will restrict some background apps. It's not gonna let your screen get as bright, things like that, but it definitely will extend your battery life. As you can see here, they estimate about 20 hours. So just know that, that that's just a simple, quick and easy way to do it. Now from there, we're going to go to our gaming section. And for gaming, you're going to want to be able to change the gaming graphics. So you can actually basically lower the resolution on most of your games so that it won't drain your battery as much. Now, obviously you can drain the resolution all the way and keep the frame rate up if you wanna do that or vice versa. But if you obviously lower both, this will improve your battery life dramatically. But I would keep frame rate high and resolution low if you want the uh, best overall gaming experience. From here, we're going to go to restart and reset and you want to turn on auto restart basically once a week you want to be able to auto restart your phone this just basically makes it so your phone is always running at optimal performance this is a good practice uh, if you don't want to do it automatically do it at least once a week restart your phone and your battery life will last longer and everything will run at top shape Okay, now the next thing is going to be, unfortunately, because this is an LCD, I do love this feature, but I would turn off always on display. This will improve your battery life a lot because this isn't OLED, the actual full screen is on at all times, uh, which uh, typically in my uh, experience has drained it about five to 10% more than if you would have had this off. Uh, so definitely better overall to keep it off if uh, possible. Next up is, of course, our screen resolution. So right here for our screen resolution, you can obviously change it to a 1080p display. And if you apply this, your phone will have a much longer battery life uh, just because the pixels aren't being pushed out as detailed. This will obviously not make all your videos look as good and detailed depending on the person, but I definitely would recommend it. 
Lastly, we would want to change our brightness on our screen to about 70 to 80 percent. Now, it's better to leave this on at all times than do auto brightness because of the fact that auto brightness is going to drain your battery more because that sensor is always on then and it's always trying to figure out if you have your screen, which brightness should it be and everything. So the just maintaining it at 80% or if you really want to do better life, 70% will make your battery life much longer than having auto brightness on. Uh, finally, um, if you do have a carrier version of this phone, the last thing you want to just take a look at is your app drawer. So for your app drawer, you just might want to get rid of all of the bloatware. So basically you can just go under the eye in that app and then see if you can, uh, disable it. Oops. There we go. And, uh, some apps will let you disable some won't, but if you can disable it, it will of course definitely make it so you have a better overall battery life. Uh, any of the bloatware you do not like from LG or from uh, T-Mobile or Sprint or anyone, if you can get rid of it, this is where you can see if you can disable it or not. All right, guys, hopefully you did like this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, why don't you go ahead and subscribe up there. Make sure you follow us on social media right here. And of course, check out our latest video up there. And right down here, you're gonna find the perfect video for you. Or at least that's what YouTube tells me. Thanks again.